Good morning, family. Welcome to today's Lessons for Life. Today is Saturday, November 14, 2009, and today we're reading in Ezra chapter 8. And <clears throat> as always, I encourage you to read these chapters too for yourself. See what you get from it. Email us and we'll put it on the blog. But uh, we see <clears throat> they're talking here even about uh, as they leave in Babylon, the, uh, proclaiming a fast uh, for the Lord to uh, go before them and really uh, protect them and keep them. Said so he was ashamed to ask the king for them because he had already kind of said that the Lord, you know, the Lord was going to be with them. Um, so now he kind of uh, looked like he was doubting his God. So we see that they they proclaim a fast, and this is just something I want to bring up that they uh, proclaimed he proclaimed a fast so that the like as a petition as he's petitioning the Lord. So this was. Um, I guess kind of his agreement or what he want, what he was going to do for the Lord to to do something for him. So uh, this is what I want to bring up for lessons for life. Just even one of the peop one of the reasons, um, a reason why people go through fast is when they're in a, uh, petitioning the Lord for something um, to be able to give up something so that the Lord will give them something. So they he was uh, fasting or proclaiming a fast amongst people so that the Lord would actually uh, be with them as they were going on their travels. So I want to bring this up and to share with you, even Bishop was mentioning last night even about um, fast. But this is one of the reasons why um, they go through a, they're going through a fast even as we read it in this chapter because they're petitioning the Lord for something. So, you know, when there's something that you are uh, seeking some kind of uh, uh, answer from or divine um, revelation or insight, then you can go on a fast because that's that's kind of like um, you have to give up something in order to get something from the Lord. So that's what I want to share with you from lesson, for lessons for life for this chapter. Just how they uh, went on a fast, and then you'll see afterwards that the result of it was that the um, the Lord was with them as they were on their travels and journeys. So with that, create yourself a wonderfully blessed day today, and we'll talk again tomorrow.